traveled more than 7,000 miles so far. He has about 4,500 more to go. A man is hoping to give homeless veterans a place to stay by walking the perimeter of the United States. Valley News Team's Krista Baim visited with Leroy Bailey on his stop in Fargo and reports on his message. I've done every state along the coast from Virginia all the way down around Florida, around Texas, to San Diego, up to Seattle. Arriving in Fargo, strapped with the bare minimum, more than 7,000 miles into his journey. Well, my feet are sore all the time, but other than that, I'm fine. Leroy Bailey is more than halfway to walking around America. Yeah, I walk until it starts getting dark and I say, God, find me a place to sleep. Bailey started in Virginia Beach, Virginia, as his frustration grew over the lack of homeless shelters. So I went and prayed about it and got to know, if you want to build shelters around America, you need to walk around America. So he did sleeping mainly outside unless he has enough cash for a hotel. A lot of times I sleep up in, under the underpass at the, on the highway. A fund started by his hometown church along with some kind strangers along the way keeps him fed but it also helps him help others. He used his donations to help a North Dakota vet get to Fargo to see a doctor. He didn't have no money and no gas so I would put a little bit of gas in his van. Leaving his wife and business back home it hasn't been easy. Oftentimes I've been treated very poorly when I walk into a church. You know, and, and that's that. You'd think that's the one place I wouldn't be judged. He's only raised 5,000 of his lofty $1 million goal to build homeless shelters, but it's not slowing him down. Whether the money gets raised or not, that's up to God. My only job is to walk. He told me walk, I walk. With 4,500 miles left to trek. It's not about me and thousands of stories behind him. It's about the people that are still homeless, especially veterans and disabled people. Krista Baim, Valley News Live. Now, Bailey will leave Fargo tomorrow, hoping to get 35 miles a day. If you want to help fund his journey or raise money to help homeless shelters, we have those links on our website. Click on this story.